torture chambers, secret passageways, vats of acid, and deadly vaults. Well, hey yo, it's all the GR6 and a half. Let's use that faulty word, goddamn world. And happy Halloween from myself, Spalding 069, to all my friends and subscribers. And you shake those fucking hands, brother. Happy Halloween. So you look about half dead. It's the fucking best time of the year, and you need to perk up because it's my favorite day of the year, and it's probably your least what. Now, you love Halloween, though, but you're kind of a church what? Well, a church lady. I won't say it either way. <laughs> I like it my own way. I like uh, it no, you do. I'm quietly. fucking with you. I know you. You're afraid of people breaking in, right? You need to worry about Christmas more than that. That's when all the idiots start breaking in and stealing presents. Yeah. How about when you called on, like years ago, you called your neighbor and told them they stole your presents and you were just hiding them under your bed. <laughs> oh, Ooh, you're not as dangerous as you used to be. But anyhow, happy Halloween, everybody. I got my ghosties and goblins out and I don't have much of a Halloween haul this year. It's just a small table of little goodies I got. Goodies, I hate that word. Why'd I just say that? But um, clap to make that shit go off, Roger. I can need to quit cursing. I won't say another curse for the whole video. I promise. Show you all my intelligence. Make the Dracula go off. They saw that in the Halloween theme horror video, right? Yes. And if you're a fucking fool, you'll go... If you're not a fool, you'll go back and watch that and get some ideas for some damn Halloween gems I know you ain't heard of, right? They need to be happy spawning his ear six nines making another video. It looks like how... how Haddonfield, Illinois out here. I swear my fucking street looks just like it by the clip y'all just saw. Walking down the sidewalk, man. I really, that's one thing I like about this hick town is it really feels like a small town, you know? You gotta take with the good with the bad. But my Halloween tree is up and I'm gonna slow my talk down. And let me just show y'all the few things I got that, you know, small but, you know, quality over quality. Quality over quality. Quantity over quality. Quality over quantity. Let me get it right. Little Dracula um, candle holder. I thought that was really cool and detailed. Just, you know, y'all seen these candles in my last video, the Halloween theme Hera. The jack o' lantern, uh, awesome light up candle, electronic, electronic, of course, you know, battery operated. A skeleton with one eye hanging out. I put fake eyes in it, but really fucking sturdy and heavy like I said in my last video if somebody breaks in here I've got heavy decor to fucking crack a skull with a skull right Paul yeah, Go, eh. yeah. yeah this house my sister gave me looks like kind of reminds me of a whole house night of the demons ish black house uh, Frankenstein candle holder a little ghosty let me turn this cutie pie on this guy doesn't really shine much, but he's it's lit in there. He just a cool skull with a jack-o'-lantern tuxedo suit. This, uh, I really like this, man. This is pretty awesome. This is made out of real wax. And, of course, there's an electronic thing in there, which is cool. It's a candle made out of real wax. It doesn't, it's not going to melt, so you can smell it. You want to smell it? Smell it. it. smells like candy corn. And... Yeah, that's my little table of small decor that, you know, adds and on. got ghosts up there. Yeah, they saw the ghosts up there, Raj. And, uh, Haddonfield out there. But I love this clown. It's creepy as shit to me. He reminds me of Pennywise with his down. I don't know. He just looks sinister with his wrinkles on his forehead and evil looking, man. I got him in, like, CVS for, like, 30 bucks. It was on sale from 80 but I'll click him and let you hear it. Use his hands and everything. Yeah, he's an evil son of a bitch. Yeah, they cut off again. But yeah, he's evil. And here's the most evil prop I have. This beautiful fucking goddamn ancient thing I dug up out of my backyard. And he's cute as a button, but I'm going to keep him. What do you think? I think you ought to keep me not throw me on the duck truck. <laughs> what does that mean? Well, yeah, here's my jack-o'-lantern lights. We're psychos. We live in an institution, if y'all didn't know, right? 
and my old school pumpkins that I carved myself leading up to the new one I did this year, of course, and July. Night of the Demons, Silver Bullet, Reverend Low, that was which best werewolf movie ever made in my opinion. Y'all can keep never mind, I'm not gonna cuss. And Dante Tomaselli's movie that I love and praise so good all the time, all his movies. Yeah, I worked quite hard on this. I had to make this image myself and um I mean it's an image from the movie, but I had to make it in black and white and make it so it's carvable. I think it turned out pretty well. The demonic evil nun and desecration. Yeah. It should do Dante Tomaselli. It should do you so good and proud. No. <laughs> I think you'll like it, man. I think he's already seen it. Yeah, I sent him a picture of it, but yeah, I was pretty proud of this. Here's the small little pupils you can see in her eye and her little veil or whatever they call that over the, the headdress. I believe she's going to come after me. Uh, tried to get her to light a candle earlier and I wouldn't light. Just like in the movie. She's so fucking evil. This Jacko, pretty Jacko. Yeah. Yeah. You know, on the dark corridors to my dungeon of hair, as I saw the hair movies and everything. But uh, Mr. Grim Reaper still holding it down. Poster just fell off. House of a Thousand Corpses. So nobody wants Rob. My room just doesn't want Rob Zombie in here. Even though I do like him, I love hate thing with him, but. Uh, Angela doesn't want anything to do with Captain Spaulding. My skeleton lights fell apart. I'm having like a goddamn haunting in here just because of that poster. Everything's falling apart. Looks like the, uh, this kind of looks like the evil demonic. This is where I keep my possessed toys like in The Conjuring, you know. They're all evil as hell. And this is where I lock Roger up because he's so evil. Yeah, the Demons 2 poster. Now I'm just going to go in a horror, you know, room showing. The killer party uh, picture I drew, I think turned out pretty awesome. Just done with crayons and pencil, so pretty proud of that. Captain Spaulding and his fat ass, and uh, nah, he ain't fat, I'm just playing. Which board? All the vintage Halloween cereals. You know, not that new school shit that they sell. This is actually sold at Target get the vintage and I think I heard uh, what's his name for full moon trying to sell these double price on his website what a prick thing to do even though I love Charles Band but damn yeah, yeah. that's it y'all and I'm gonna show y'all my front yard real quick my pink house <laughs> told y'all living in a pinkish house but uh here's my little jack-o-lantern sidewalk uh, decor little small little graveyard right here in the counter lighting up and shit uh, I meant not meant not to cuss again. Tombstone. Yeah, my demon head. <laughs> Just a psychotic demon. And Halloween tree uh, in the winder. Another tombstone light up hand right there. Pretty badass. And uh, my beware sign. Cause you better beware when you come to this bitch. You see me in your reflection, don't you? All right, later, y'all. Happy Halloween.